You're early. Surprising. You're still an asshole. Not surprising. Mm -hmm. So. Yes, so. You called me. We miss you at work. <laughs> you could have sent a card or an email for that. There's no need for us to actually see each other to communicate. I thought you got a card. I did. You didn't sign it. Are you sure? Positive. Everybody signed it. Even Jackson. Huh. Thought I signed it. Put a little smiley face with a, with a tear. Yeah, no smiley face anywhere on that card. Fine. Let's cut to the chase. Let's. I hear you're opening your own business. And who told you that? Jackson. <sighs> he always was a chatty bitch. Well, is he a chatty bitch spreading rumors? Oh, no, no. He's a chatty bitch telling the truth. Are you diving into the frozen yogurt business while it's still hot? It's a personal puncher business. Our clients place orders of people they'd like to punch, and we make that happen. I miss that wit around the bakery. Well, once I fill my next puncher order, you'll see that I'm not kidding. I will sue you for stealing industry secrets if you open your own business. So that's why you wanted to meet. Because you wanted to threaten me. Are you too cheap for a lawyer? There's no need for lawyers. Yet. Mm -hmm. We can save ourselves all of that annoying paperwork. I was just letting you know what will happen if you do. I'm here with Kat Winston of Winston Cupcake. It's Katie, not Kat. What are you doing? Kat has threatened to sue me if I open my own company. Are you recording this? I am, and the camera does not love you. Stop it! I have the right not to be videotaped! I'm sorry, what, what year do you live in? You cannot steal my recipes and open your own bakery. It is against the law. Uh, your recipes or your grandmother's recipes or your grandfather's roommate Lance's recipes? Turn that off. Say hello to YouTube, bitch. Turn that off! I'd sit down, Katie, sit. You want lawyers? Lawyers you get. See, that got your attention. You're just this angry, borderline bipolar nut job. But you make a good cupcake. And if you think that you can just steal my cupcake recipes and dive into the cupcake business in this economy, you are fucking dreaming, darling. And that's what you're scared of. People are just not buying cupcakes like they used to. Times get tough, people cut back. Cupcakes, not high on that list of necessities. So things are slow at Winston Cupcakes? I might have to close the second location. Sorry to hear that. Yes, well, I'm just telling you, from business person to business person, that there are only so many cupcakes you can sell in this city. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a big city. That's what I used to think, too. Mm -hmm. See, the cupcake business and bookstores have a lot in common. I read about people making their own cupcakes at home all the time. I'm not opening a cupcake bakery. You're not? Mm -mm. No. Frozen yogurt. No, I'm not opening a, a Leslie's Cupcakes or anything involved with yogurt. So then why didn't you just say Jackson was lying? Because he's not. I'm opening a cookie bakery. Cookies. Just cookies. Yes, just cookies. Well, why don't you open a bookstore slash frozen yogurt business? Hell, you could sell CDs there, too. You're such an asshole. God, cookies are so over. Cookie, nobody wants cookies. Really? Yes. It's like, it's, it's, it's like basic human behavior. I mean, you could take a cupcake and a cookie in a time machine. A, a time machine. Yes, a time machine. And you could, you could take this cookie and this cupcake back to a caveman. Oh, okay. Well, are you planning on uh, expanding your business to different times in history? Just go with me. So the cupcake and the cookie are presented to the caveman. Caveman test marketing. Listen, the caveman picks the cupcake every single time. Really? Yeah. Since now, since the dawn of history, a cupcake will kick a cookie's ass every time. We have 25 hotels buying our cookies. You're already in business? The week after I left, Cookie Castle opened. A business called Cookie Castle has 25 hotels buying cookies? Each cookie is stamped with a little castle. It's my mother's recipe, and her maiden name is Castle. May I?
Leslie Rowland. That is a good goddamn motherfucking cookie. Thank you. Are you stealing my customers? No, I'm not selling cupcakes. Because the customers loved you. Because you're just so annoyingly fucking likable. It's a curse. No, and they hear that you're selling cookies, they're gonna go to your place and not my place. I don't have a storefront. I just fill orders, okay? No individual customers, okay? Just hotels, restaurants, and you know, a couple of companies buy them for their employees. Really? Yeah, it lowers overhead. Smart. Thanks. Do you have any plans to open a storefront? In this economy? No, but if, if, if business slows, I'll lay off some people and I'll <laughs> bake everything myself. You have employees. Yeah, Katie, I, uh, I'm sorry that your business is slow, but my business will have no impact on your business, okay? Yeah, I guess. Finn, I have an appointment with a potential client, and I, I like to be early. You. Early. Oh, yes. Being early is good for business. I like to get there 20 minutes before the meeting, and I let the room just fill up with the scent of fresh-baked cookies. Mm -hmm. That is pure evil genius. I, I know. Anyway. Are we cool? Yeah, we're cool. Oh, you know, I... I <laughs> this client who asked about uh, cupcakes. No. After five years, I don't want to see another fucking cupcake. I'll send them your way. I'd appreciate that. Thank you. You know, Katie, it's a big world. And there's room for all of us. Cookies. <laughs> Years we've been together, seems we can't get along. No matter what I do, it don't appeal to you. Makes no difference whether. I am right or I'm wrong If we can't be sweethearts And you're still a bitch <laughs> When I'm gone Oh honey, though our friendship ceases from now on And listen, if you can't say anything real nice it's better not to talk at all is my advice We're parting, you go your way, I'll go mine It's best that we do Here's a kiss, I hope that this brings lots of luck to you Makes no difference how I carry on Remember, please don't talk about me when I'm gone. Seems we can't get along. Stephanie Rodriguez! No matter what I do, 